just make sure if it was in the shipping for a week or so, you want to make sure it's stuck down pretty good to the paper underneath. Apply it up to your wall where you want it. And when this design's coming right out of the corner, and I applied a few pieces of tape just to, to help me along. Let me peel off this part. <laughs> peel off that part. That's what we're going to want to hold on here. Push that down. And as you can see, this curls up relatively. <laughs> okay, Brooklyn, we'll be there in one second. This uh, masking tape is like painter's tape. It's designed not to stick to your wall to peel off paint and stuff. So that's why it's going to curl off. You just put it on there to get your graphic on the wall. Right now we're going to peel the uh, back piece off so we can pull this down now as we're set up to go. The important part here is to peel it so that the graphic sticks to your masking tape and not the, the paper backing. You can begin to peel the backing off on such an angle that nothing's sticking. And I'm watching out for these lines here to make sure nothing's getting hooked up on the paper. So yeah, it's important to start from the middle and work your way down and up or vice versa. To avoid air pockets, increases in the graphic. Now since we've got such a good surface here that's holding the graphic down, if I let this fall, it's not going to go anywhere. So I can remove some of this paper that's on the back that's kind of getting in my way. I'll just tear that off because I don't want it getting in my way. There's an example of how it came up here. So we can just touch that back on. Like so. Here's an example of when I was pulling the paper off that part of the graphic didn't want to come. So if I roll my finger back and in behind I'm pressing down in the spot, let's press my finger on that, get a better angle, and it'll come, it'll stay. And it's important when you're peeling it off, don't pull it off like this. You want to keep it tight to the wall and then pull it down like this, keeping the masking tape really tight against the, the wall. And then you can see here the graphic wanted to come up. So we're just going to go put it back, go with the credit card or whatever card you have, press down a little bit harder on there, and then it'll stick again. So that's the part there that would really worry people if they're pulling their graphic on and it starts to stick. Don't panic. Put your masking tape back on. Go over the spot that was coming up on you. And then peel again. So it's all about the angle. And sometimes if you rock the masking tape like this, it helps. And here's another spot right here. So as you can see, it's a really pointy part in this graphic. Well, I'm gonna, I didn't go down hard enough on it, so I'll do it again there, and then it'll stick. If you run into one like this that doesn't want to come down, you can just peel it off the back, 
and help it because this is such a, 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 a small piece that the masking tape wants to hold on to it. So you can just peel it off here, get it on back on the wall, press that down for something really because it's a really small fine point. That's why that one will want to pull away on you because as, as you can see something like this doesn't want it, it comes off no problem. And then you get the points like that. It might give you a bit of an issue. A lot of scrubbing on like that. This one here. This one here. Take your time. This one part here got caught on me underneath. When I was initially peeling the paper off, but this is very forgiving material, vinyl, so I can just go under and pick this up and position it back where I want it. So I'm going to move that back to where it belongs. That's the first part of this, and then I have a bottom piece that's going to go here. Okay? A, a damp um, paper towel on a matte finish wall. Not a lot of uh, water, just damp enough to wipe down any residual paint residue that's left on the wall. And line up the second part of this graphic with where it meets the first part here. And I can go over it a little bit. Right over top, just a little bit, so it meets. Now with this one, we're gonna come down. And we wanna keep it tight as possible when we're coming down. And again, you only want to go so far. Starting in the middle, side to side. Coming down. Okay. Give it another good run with the card over top. And when you peel it off, you want to keep it, again, nice and close to the wall. Not like this. You want to have it tight to the wall. And it's a good idea when you come into an area of the graphic, if you have your hand underneath sometimes, you can help just rub it as you're going along. Make sure it's sticking. Like that's coming off there. So I'm just pushing underneath as I pull down. And then there, I'm going to put back up down under it to get it right off and it's up. 